dehumidifier is back on again. I thought you were going to do that. Hello! Hello! We're just doing another thing. We couldn't get Aladdin to work, so... Yeah, we're going to play Aladdin for the SNES. Yeah. Let's see if we can actually beat that, because I don't know how the game goes. I don't even know either. So we're just putting this out there, and we might come do it every now and then. Don't Probably. expect constant videos on it. Knowing you, there won't be. No. Knowing me, there won't be. Because I hate this game. And it's surprising how much I praised the first one. Yeah, it's like, man, you sound like half the Lion King fans I've heard of. <laughs> well, this one's just because you'll see. Fuck off, EA. You saw we're done with Chrome Studio. Did the turn the volume again? Dude, you're. But one brave Fucker. stood up to Cass. No, he didn't. Number one. Talismans. Jesus. He risked all in an effort to save his family and friends. And in the end, he succeeded. Cass was banished for his crimes, and the land was made safe once again. All also considering most of Australia's population is warm-blooded and Boss Cass is warm-blooded <laughs> He literally is attacking mammals, not warm-blooded, not just warm-blooded creatures Also, there's a cold-blooded goat that lives in a cave with a Satan-looking skull <laughs> Also, there's kart racing in this game Yay! Spanish are doing nuts and bolts, like I said If I will be save file three on memory card one. We're not gonna come back to this game, mostly because I don't like this game. Yeah. You are like most Lion King fans, it's like, oh the originals or just anything that gets a secret. Oh. Like, the original's the best. Like a Gen 1 or a Ty. Oh look a crocodile. Oh, yeah, there's Ranger Ken. And a Kiwi's flying the helicopter. It's like you driving in GTA 5. Yeah! Straight up. It took him time. A little country town of Karawong is under attack. What map would want to do this? The local security is in the thick of it. One of their mates is holed up at the old barracks. Oh, this is shocking. Oh, geez, Sly, what happened to you? It's like he'd be done cocaine. Also, he has a cigarette in his mouth. I think that's a toothpick. Why isn't his mouth moving? Oh, yeah, Shazza has a machine gun. Sweet. Yeah, she can fight in this game. Also, I kind of why she's a dingo. I told you already. Yeah, but let I mean, everybody else know. It's because thylacines and dingoes are actually distantly related to each other. Actually related to each other. They have evolved from the same creature potential. Oh yeah, they all have laser guns, the koalas. What the fuck? Are we playing Star Wars? Yeah, it's pretty much Tie Wars. It's Rang 1. <laughs> That's it! I can use that as a thumbnail! Yeah! Rang I mean, one. if we do good, if we do good, this can be our full playthrough, but... Oh my god. I'm ne Han Solo is a koala. Goddamn. Oh! Come on, buddy. Put the bushfire for us. The fire's out. Let's go. What the hell is going on? Well, 
Yeah, it's pretty much Star Wars, Rogue One. So that means everyone dies again. Maybe. Apparently not, because there's a third and a fourth tie. You son of a bitch! Look out! Cannonettis! Cannonettis! Nettie, what happened to you? I thought we were friends, Nettie! Maybe they're different Nettis. Maybe. But they're a villain. Cannonettis. They just carry big cannons. It's like the original title, there's no context for any of the characters or any of the story. At least they keep the same gameplay mechanics. Sort of. Yeah, but it's like, why? We have to get to the other side of the bridge. See that battle bunion? Maybe you can use it to clear the debris block of the park. Why? Who's debris? I heard of Debbie. I heard of Dupree. He Never said Debris. Dupree. I know, but I'm mad. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Look at all these thrills. Alright, this there... is the one good part about this game. Why is there a war going on? Now everything is safe. No. It isn't. Ties on crack and he's got a. I do love the mechs. I wish the mechs were in the first game. Especially the final mech we get. And yes, we get to keep this mech! Oh yeah, Frills can jump in this game now. Help these little koalas out! What do you think about the koalas' little ray guns? Was it just like all cold-blooded things are inherently evil? Well, no. The frills are just being little dicks. Yeah, that seems to be the plot of this game. Or this series. Well, no. The frills are just used by the villain. That's it. They're not evil at all. Yeah, but if Ty has committed mass murder on their race... Mercy with his teeth, bud. Oh, yeah. What? Yeah, there's giant robots. Neon Genesis Stylusing. He did. Need to help you, mate. Don't worry about me. <laughs> there's a battle mortar in the old barracks. It's the only thing that can defend the ground troops from those demon fluffies. On there. <laughs> you little beauty. And we never see him again. Dave. I'm sorry, but. See, even fluffies. You know what those are. Thorny devils, which are lizards. Which is still funny because the guy who tried to eliminate all the worm blooded creatures is a worm blooded creature. Yeah, remember in the first game he did explain why it is so that he's doing all no, that. No, he doesn't. He beats the shit out of a frill and then. Well, he says the reason why he's. He says he's going to destroy all warm blooded creatures except himself. This is the plot of Pokemon. But also, if you're a dead end, nothing can happen. You are doomed if you do that. Actually, the only plus side is they're not carnivorous birds, they eat fruit. Most carnivores, most herbivores, most creatures in Australia are warm blooded. Most exceptions are, well, well are lizards, saltwater crocodiles, which are also lizards, 
freaking sharks and stuff like that. It's just, you're expected to know the entire plot off the get go, and that's it. What did they tell you the plot? Alright. No, of the entire series. Hmm. And this is the part that made me rage quit as a kid. Cool. You're com this is World War II, basically, but with mechs. This is every mech anime out there. Why? Because he killed it? What? Why did they You'll see. This part. Shez's voice is irritating me because it's so not Shez's voice. This is like almost every move. Oh, it's down. Get him. Jesus Christ. Or as the Australians say, Crikey. The boss? No. The dude the boss is named after. Oh, but Ophina is in the field. What the ever living in hell are we looking at? You're supposed to destroy all these ships. Why in the transition from. Oh, it's just a fun little trip, y'all. Get the opals and the thunder eggs to full on civil war. Wait, where did the coral? Where did the transition go? We're to slide 1.5, so we know what the fuck happened. So we did this. God. Oh, Jesus. Oh. It's the best. Yes, hey. It's Mojo Jojo. That's what the dropship's faces look like. Let's take care of those demon oh my god, I did it on my first attempt. What's that? Her vo <laughs> Fluffy! <laughs> she blew a kiss to me. I, everyone's voices are gone. I just let her break in. No big deal. She actually won't break in unless you come in. Well, well, well. The little orange rat has come out. Ah, wah, 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 wah. That's how she moved. <laughs> what? Uh, that was easy. Go oh, fuck! She dropped a bomb. Oh, there's a scuttle butt. Look at the little scuttle butts. Why is it a civil war? What is even? Uh... Don't worry. This is just in the beginning of the game. And then nothing happens for the rest of it. Pretty much. Ugh. This is where all the action goes in. It's funny because they're throwing devils or well oh, they they're thorny and they bleed out of their eyes. Yee! Metal ring. Did you see how fast she was going? And Oh yeah, you and these are. Now? Oh wow. 
Oh yeah. Meet our new enemies. Oh, saltwater crocs with frills. They're roid frills. Oh. It says, I only throw lizards have teeth. Come in, you pin! You know what's funny? Do you know why there are white people in Australia? Why? Because during part of the American Revolutionary War, several of the, of the British soldiers were banished as prisoners to a little place called Australia. Huh. That and then Captain Cook decided to banish everybody. Decided to explore and purge the place. He just cuts off his hand. Oh. He's too close. Kiwi That's now. Oh god, Ken. That is not a good place to hang on, Ken. Does the Kiwi. Do they live? Yeah, yeah. they would have crashed if Ty wasn't there. Is that Kiwi ever do it? He's just like. Uh. He didn't even need a jail of it. I'm no longer a jailbird! Not if I can help it! You're extinct! He tried to fly! He tried to fly! So long, loser! Can I tell you something? What? I've never gotten this far this fast. What happened? Cats go to work. His mouth didn't even move. Yeah, mate. If it wasn't for you, I would have been dead, mate. I could have done better. Next time, I'll be ready. They're still killing each other in the background. Oh my god. What? It's just... The fact that none of the characters have their original voices... Mm hmm That's a thing that annoys me. And that there's no explanation for this transition, not even in the opening cutscene. Explain that things have gone to cast. This isn't just some utopia. There's an actual war going on. Is this like the e the freaking emu war? It is with great pride that I cut this ribbon and officially declare open for a Machi Push rescue. Just that one dingo just with the mm -hmm. little gloves. It's a state-of-the-art facility with an observation tower, research lab, airstrip, and advanced headquarters. Hey, Murray, come on out. That's you, Possum. Hey, look. She's actually wearing pants. Get on, young mate. Dennis, you won't regret this. With Bush His rescue, mouth! Ready to take on Boss Kess the next time he strikes. Did Where's you see home? that? Uh, I mean, Dennis's well, mouth moves fine, but Ty is in it. It's an immunity community. He moved to the United States. Oh my God, is Boss Cast Donald Trump? No. <laughs> Better. Better. This is a good His name is Cassopolis. Diplomats are above the law as long as they're here on official Cassopolis business. I can double pack, open other people's mind, and leave the milk out. And Sergeant Bluey can't touch him. Which is why it's important for us to find out what his plans are and catch him in the act. Well, there's no time to stand around gas bags. What? I know, I don't even know what the term sandbagging is. The local council has been complaining about crocodiles in the sewers, mate. Go see Ranger Ken to sort it out. So far, we'll just finish that mission and so then that will be it. So far, Murray sounds about right. Does Julius even do anything in this game? Is he even in the game? <laughs> Three is a certain... Oh, look! He's a... He's not dead! Nope. He's useless. Okay, cool. Man, nobody does anything except talk. Okay. Nettie? Hello. 
No. Yeah, that's Nettie, I think. There's Nettie. I love Black Bush Rescue. He's just gotten some grandma since that different voice. Crikey, you're a frillism. What are you doing here? What does it look like? I'm working, mate. Not all lizards are bad, you know. Don't be so racist. My name's Sneath, and your mate over there is Keith. G'day. Sneath and Keith. I'm the cook, and he's the mechanic. Although we sometimes swap jobs. Either way, I'm usually up to my elbows in grease. Uh, righto. I also take care of the bush rescue training program. If you want to scrub up on your rescue skills, just meet me over at that sign. I can't. This is. No, I'm not gonna. I do can't that believe shit. the tie is racist to wizards. I shouldn't be surprised though. Eat the minions. Give them what they deserve. Death. And they're all dead. Nice. What the hell? Are those bags of opals? Yep. I just came down to get these because I remember they were there. I don't remember what's out here. You don't have aqua rings. I don't think so. No, Ty learned to swim since then. He didn't need them. I do like how clear the water looks. It does look, it is a nice effect. <coughs> you gotta admit though, the graphics are a lot better to look at. I know, it's just Ty's mouth is infinitely worse now. Oh, bro, he just ate mud. What are those? Again, what do those things do? Because I'm an idiot and still don't know. What is that? This? This is the loading areas. This is literally what you wait to while you're loading. Meet the hub world! Why well, new rise? Which I am gonna show off. Also, this is Sly's girlfriend! Hello, Ty. Does she actually do anything in this game? How do we know that? Because it's confirmed in Ty 3. Oh. Hello, Ty. Apparently not, because apparently it's Shazza. Hey, look! His parents! Glad you can make it into me, Sean. I've got some cute boomerangs for sale today. Choose carefully, though. We have a no-returns policy. He's <laughs> got a great side of runs, and if I get... I already know what word I'm going to describe his mom in this. What? Two words. What? Extra thick. <laughs> look at her! Bye, son. Yeah. Now we got the flamerangs! Extra thick! And remember in the last playthrough? Here he is! Don't light everyone on fire, God. It was amazing, I tell you. <laughs> you ain't seen anything like it. No, sir. But they got the voice for um, Lenny back, I think. At least 20. No, no, make that 100 feet tall. Well, to a liar birdie, be like. It was all like, yeah. And he was jumping all over the place. Yeah, because you can't hit him. I don't remember going it that way. I remember Bullpen kicking her ass for a long time. I don't remember. I don't know. I don't remember, but I haven't seen that episode in a little bit. Ambulance! Oh shit, that was the cops, I hope you know. It said police on it. Shh, it's the ambulance. It's the ambulance. Oh god! <laughs> so next time. Whatever gonna, that is. Well, no. We're oh, gonna do, look at the shine effect on the water. Ooh, what? Pant. Oh, wow. No, no, no. Pant. Pant. No, get. Move the camera a bit. Ta-da! Wow. Yeah, we're going to at least do this first mission, and then that will be it for a while. 
Yeah. Okay. Ty, can you? Oh my God. Till next Carl. time.